Yo, what is going on, guys? I am bringing you a 200,000 puck coin currency pack opening where I'll be opening the 8.75 gold packs as well as the 17.5k jumbo packs. Looking for a milestone card, a legend card, a team of the week, a high overall card, anything. This is not a live commentary, the heads up, but I do pull a few nice things, but I'm not going to spoil anything. So if you want to find out what I get, you can watch full video. And I sped it up for a reason because originally it was like 11 minutes and that's too long in my opinion, especially since it wasn't a live commentary. But I speed it up a little bit faster. It's not that fast where you can't see what's going on, but it's definitely a bit quicker. You know, it saves you five, six minutes. It saves me five, six minutes for making an idiot of myself. But anyway, in this time, I'm going to explain a few things why I have been away from YouTube. I kind of said that in the last episode, which I said I was just enjoying life more and... I don't know, I still am, as well as a few games coming out that are fun, but the main reason for why I have not really been uploading that much is because, to me, NHL 15 on Xbox One isn't that great of a game. I mean, I would say it's a pretty good game, like, a, I'd give it like a 7 out of 10. The gameplay is pretty fun, presentation is really good, but other than that, I mean, I don't know, so many parts of the game feel flat, a taking out... ESHL is a huge, like, ah, I played that so much in all the NHL games ever since it came out, as well as Hut just feeling a bit dry in my opinion, things just take so long to load and stuff, at first I didn't mind it, I liked it because it looked a lot better, but it just takes a lot longer to load, and on top of that, I just, I don't know, I wasn't having fun playing, and what I think I'm going to do is, even though I have a ton of really good free players, I think I'm just going to restart over on a new team, change up the series one more time, but this time, just have it do whatever I want because I was reading some of the comments many people liked the last episode of the Deke Street which which I did like it was kind of like a GM thing but I was getting a few comments of people saying that they want me just to do whatever I want and try to build the best team I can and I think that's probably the best thing to do as well as try to go for the best record so like road to division one I can go back to like I did last year and a lot of people like that series as well as still bringing in the tributes and stuff but I don't know just keep changing the rules gets really confusing and I think having no rules is probably the best bet and I'm just gonna try to go to division one and I think I'm gonna make the episodes a lot shorter instead of 15 minutes I think I'm gonna keep them around six to ten minutes have three to four games and maybe a tribute a few new changes some pack openings and that'll be it and I'll get more videos out I'll be more motivated to do that instead of having to play 15 games or so and get all those clips in there and then I'll get three new players and have them do three tributes for video it's just very frustrating sometimes, I do enjoy it, I love the editing, sometimes, sometimes I'm not in the mood to it, but this game, like, I won't be able to play for two or three days, and then I'll come back and be like, okay, I gotta play 15 games for the one episode of the Deke Street, I'm not in the mood to play 15, I'll play one or two, I'll lose, and I'll be like, this game is so frustrating, and I honestly think that's a main reason why I haven't been active, is because I'll come on and I'll be like, I need to, like, get a whole episode of the Deke Street, so I need to get all the clips, I need to play like 15 games, it's going to take so long, and on top of that, like, I get frustrated. I don't know why I can't score, but anyway, that's besides the point. Maybe I'm not good at this game, maybe bad luck, whatever it is. I need to, I think, reduce that so I could actually play, because even if I lose, I know I'm not the best player in this game. I know I'm not amazing in this game. I think I'm good, but I'm not great, so, again, I'm going to expect the losses and stuff like that, so. don't really care about that, it's just the whole fact of playing like 15 games, as well as wanting to bring GM, but... I finally played by my, like, I finally played, I have never even touched GM, I was waiting for that update, but I finally played a bit, played about half the season with the Devils alone, and to be honest, I don't really like it, I mean, I think the drafting, like the, well, not the drafting, the scouting, I didn't even see the drafting yet, but the scouting was pretty cool, besides that, seems like a big downgrade to NHL 14, or probably 15 on the last gen, obviously, because that's the same thing, but a little bit better this year for the last gen. But, yeah, I think I'll try bringing that back. Maybe I'll get NHL 15 for the Xbox 360, and I'll bring a GM series back from that, as well as maybe some other stuff. But I have some other things in mind for... I want to come back. I have some other things in mind. Probably going to get a wager mode going. Well, well, yeah, wager mode in there, something like that. Maybe I'll do some Q&As, as well as bring the Deke Street back a lot shorter. Definitely a lot more episodes. I'll still bring out those like big pack openings, not just like one or two. I'll bring out like when I do them, like this episode, it's 200k worth, and you know, trying to get some good stuff, which I did pull the James Neal as you saw. But yeah, I think to be honest, I'm gonna be back. Well, I'm gonna be back, but 
I'm sorry that I went on a bit of a break. I uploaded like three videos in the past two or three weeks, and I'm sorry about that, but I just didn't have any motivation. It's finally back, but like I said again, I'm going to be bringing back some new series. And the last idea I have is I'm thinking of bringing some new games to this channel. Again, this is still probably going to be most likely 99% this is going to be an NHL channel. That is what I built it on. That's what all I have my subscribers in, my fans in. So I'm going to keep it an NHL channel, but I think on the side note, when I'm bored of this game or need a break, I'm going to bring some other games. So if you guys don't mind, that would be awesome. I'll probably bring some, you know, some videos that everyone can relate to. Like when I did last year, I did those topic videos and I'll just be playing other games. But otherwise, it's going to be an NHL channel. I'm going to be bringing some new series to the table. Not sure when I'm going to restart this, but I promise I will be back and better than I have been. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and comment your thoughts down below. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>